Hey folks, today I wanted to show you the integrated order requests from Connex down to Apex Dispatch. Connex can be configured to talk bidirectionally to Apex to synchronize orders. This can be used internally between two divisions or from customers to the supplier. Let's take a look. On the left, I have my Apex Dispatch set up. And on the right, I've logged into Connex with my web browser as the customer would. So the customers have a buyer menu with access to submit orders. If we click it, you can see here, this is my summary list of orders for this customer for today. So at the top, the end user can optionally filter by dates or by date range and can optionally look up orders on the screen. At a glance, you can see we show the Connex order number, the Apex or on-prem order number, and we show the status. We support multiple statuses and we'll synchronize that with Apex. We show other basic information about the order, the product, the quantities, and the start times. And we can optionally click on these orders to see more details. In this case, my order 36 is in Apex and is confirmed and has been ticketed. You can see this at the top with a simple label, as well as the ticket list here. You'll also notice once a order has been ticketed, we do not let the user make changes to this order. Instead, a new order would have to be created. So let's create a new order and see it integrated. I'll click the Create Order Request button at the bottom. So this is my order entry screen. You'll notice it automatically populated my supplier because I only have one. I can select only projects that are set up for me as a customer in Apex. Having done so, it can optionally automatically populate certain information such as the delivery address or purchase order. I can then pick my delivery date. I can select my products from my project set up in Apex. I can select my quantity, what plant that should come from, my spacing, and then any optional notes at the bottom. And then I can save. Upon saving, my order will be in my list according to delivery time. So my order is here in requested status at the bottom. This indicates that the order is not yet synchronized to Apex and could still be canceled by the customer. Once this is integrated or synchronized, this status will change to pending. So let's refresh and find our order. So you notice now it is in pending status so if I go over here, I should be able to find my order in Apex. And here it is. Now I can change my order to committed and save. And I can go ahead and ticket this order as well. So now if we go back to Connects and refresh, You can see our order now shows the Apex order number. It is in confirmed status and actually shows our tonnage uh, on our ticket already delivered. You can also see this ticket as the buyer under the accept materials page. Finally, if I log in as the supplier in Connects, I can also access and see all of my Apex orders here I can optionally edit them or even create new orders here as well, just like the customer would. That's all folks. Thanks and have a great day.